All right, so I wanted to talk to you about how long you need to stay out of the pool once you put your chemicals in the pool. Well, let me start by saying this. Number one, your balance chemicals are not going to hurt you. Adjusting your pH are not going to affect you in any way. So when you put these chemicals in, you can swim. You can throw them in there while you're swimming. None of that matters, okay? These are all real mild chemicals. You don't have to worry about this kind of stuff. Now, keep in mind that if you're putting a lot of your balance chemicals in, it's a white powder, and you might put it in the water, and it's going to make your water a little murky for a little bit because you just threw a bunch of white powder in it, okay? But as far as healthiness, as far as that, do your thing and swim. The only thing that's really going to affect you or irritate you is if you're a chlorine user and you're shocking once a week. When you put that shock in, that powder chlorine, it's going to raise your chlorine level up real high, real fast. You're going to notice that it might bleach your bathing suit out, fade your bathing suit a little bit. It's going to dry your skin out a little bit. It's going to irritate your skin a little bit. What I recommend, you know, this is what I do with my pool, and this is what I recommend everybody do. Because the, the problem is if you go out there Saturday morning and you throw shock in your pool, nobody's going to really want to swim until Saturday night. You know, rule of thumb is, is once you shock your pool, you really want to give it about eight hours to kind of calm down before people are in there swimming. Okay. And, and I'm really playing it safe with the eight hours, but that's what I recommend. My best advice to you so that you never interrupt your swimming season is when you put your chemicals in, do it at night. Okay. Again, I'm really only talking about your chlorine. Do your balanced chemicals and your pH or whatever. Do that whenever you want. But if you're going to shock your pool once a week, I would pick the nighttime. Let your pump run all night. When the kids wake up in the morning, when you wake up in the morning, you hop in the pool and you enjoy it. And if you do it that way, it's never going to interrupt your swimming season. Okay, so that's my recommendation to you with putting the chemicals in your pool.